Hello student, the question says the primary coil of a transformer is connected to 220 volt AC. The primary and the secondary turns of the transformer are 110 respectively. The secondary coil of the transformer is connected to two series resistance as shown in the figure. What is the output voltage V0? So as given this is 100 turns and this is 10 turns. We need the output voltage. So since this is given as 100 turns and this is given as 10 turns we can find v output so v input by v output is number of turns in the input by number of turns in the output so based on that we can write 220 by v out equals to 100 by 10 so simply we get v output is equals to 22 volts once you understand that the v output is 22 volts now, don't be confused with these terminals and all that. It is given only so that you can understand what is happening. You can just remove these if this is if these things are confusing you. Indirectly is asking you if 22 volts is supplied to this. If 22 volts is supplied to this, how much voltage will be present across the 7 kilo ohm resistor? If 22 volts is supplied to this circuit, how much voltage is present across the 7 kilo ohms resistor? Like if I remove these. If this is 22 volts, we can find what is the current in this. So the current in this would be equals to whatever is the output voltage divided by total resistance. The total resistance would be 15 plus 7. So it would be 22 kilo ohm. So it would be simply 22 by 22 kilo ohm. So we simply get 1 into 10 power minus 3 amperes. So we got the value of current. Once we get the value of the current, what is the voltage across this? Voltage across the 7 kilo ohm resistor, V is equals to current into resistance. So current is 1 into 10 power minus 3. The resistance value is 7 into 10 Q. So we simply get the value as 7 volts. We can directly see it. Since this is 22 volts, and in series, there is another way to say it, in series, Voltage is directly proportional to resistance. Since voltage is directly proportional to resistance, I can directly tell the voltage across 7 kilo ohm is simply this corresponding resistance. Like R, let me call this as R2, let me call this as R1. So you can write it as R2 by R1 plus R2 into the total sum, 22. So even if we use that also, we'll get the value as 7 volts. So don't be confused with these terminals. Hope you understood how I have solved. Thank you.